Early on, stress hormones may spike, and as time passes, that stress can become chronic. Social interactions and meaningful activities are essential for emotional stability. This may be because they provide us with what researchers call social reality testing, a sort of sounding board where we can gauge how rational our perceptions are. So, when someone's deprived of those kinds of communication and tasks, their sense of identity and reality becomes threatened. Their thoughts spiral and their impulses take the reins, setting the stage for depression, obsessions, suicidal ideation, and, for some, delusions and hallucinations. Over time, this prolonged agitation can cause the brain's limbic system, which regulates fear and stress, to become especially responsive and hyperactive. Meanwhile, the prefrontal cortex, the brain's hub for reasoning and moral judgment, may shrink, impairing one's focus, memory, and cognition. Overall, the balance shifts from rational thinking towards emotionality. And as someone remains in this state, the imbalance becomes ingrained, making them more prone to bouts of anxiety, rage, and irrational actions. <laughs>